Hello grade 10s and welcome to today's lesson. We are going to go through problems that require mixed factorizations. There are five methods of factorization. Let's go over them again. The methods of factorization are finding a common factor, difference of two square, trinomials, grouping, and sum or difference of two cubes. Let's look at some steps that will help us choose the right method to use. The first step should always be to look for the highest common factor. If there is a highest common factor, factorize it and then move to step two. If there isn't a common factor, move on to step two. If there are two terms, look for a difference of two squares or a sum or difference of two cubes. If there are three terms, factorize a trinomial. If there are four or more terms, try to group them. Each time we factorize an expression, we must remember to check if it can be factorized further. Use the step one and two to guide the process so that nothing is left out. Let's do this together. 5x cubed minus 5x squared minus 60x. Applying step one, we can see that 5x is the highest common factor. We take it out by dividing each term by the highest common factor to get the product. Using step two, we see that there is a trinomial in the brackets. We must continue to write the highest common factor on every line. The factors of negative 12 are negative 4 and positive 3, giving us 5x, open brackets, x minus 4, close brackets, open brackets, x plus 3, close brackets. Let's do another example together. Simplify. 2, open brackets, x minus 2, close brackets, squared minus 8, Step one says to look for a common factor. Let's start by taking out a common factor of two, leaving us with two open brackets, x minus two squared minus four, close brackets. Within the brackets, we see two terms, which means it should either be a difference of two squares or a difference of two cubes. As both terms are square numbers, we do a difference of two squares, giving us two, open brackets, x minus two, minus two, close brackets, open brackets, x minus two, plus two, close brackets. Add the like terms within the brackets and we have a final answer of two x, open brackets, x minus four, close brackets. Thank you for joining us, grade 10s. Remember to try the task video at the end of this section. You'll also be able to learn more about factorizing on our website, www.mindset.co.za forward slash learn. Goodbye.